Hello everyone and welcome back to the very very busy busy park that we have here in Fish Pond Park and for those of you guys who are new and not familiar with Fish Pond Park it is an adorable little pickful game made by Cairo Games and I just wanted to try it out because the goal of this game is to build up a big happy beautiful park a national park by combining different cards and making different areas by finding a bunch of fish by trying to gather up lots and lots of wood so you can add expansion and more fame to your areas and we've been doing really well I actually think we're very close to kind of getting to the ending of Fish Pond Park we just have a little bit further to expand we're definitely making enough money and it has been a few months since we've actually had an episode so you guys may remember we just expanded to have a bullet train look at it go choo choo and we have so many guests coming in. I've never seen so many people here. The money we're making is just ridiculous. It's amazing. And we have tons of feed. We've got quite a bit of wood and feed and wood are what you use to expand your park and build in different areas. Um, let's see what we're studying right now. What are we researching right now? We could research removal cards or spring cards, connection cards. Let's do, I guess, an ad campaign just to bring more people in. Um, so we'll do an ad campaign to see if we can bring more people in. Harvest lessons. I'll let your little helpers gather up more harvest. I don't think we need a lot of that, but why not? And let's see, connection cards, spring cards, removal cards. We don't really need any of those, but I want to finish expanding into the different areas and start catching a bunch of the different kinds of fish. And I think, ooh, ooh we have a little present. All right, so mystery harvest, and you can appraise these mystery harvests that your people find for quite a bit of money, and sometimes there's really good stuff inside. So let's check out what's inside. Da -na 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 -na. It's onigiri. We got a little rice ball. All right. Oh, and there's something back here. Let's go ahead. <laughs> there goes all that money we were just making, and look what's inside. It's a shiitake mushroom. Wonderful. We can study those up. And actually, we're going to start looking for some fish. I think I figured out in one of the areas, and I hadn't shown you guys yet, how to find a very specific kind of fish. So I'm trying to remember. Change fish, goldfish, crustacean eel, killifish, carp. I don't think this was it. Um, let's go fishing just to see what we can find. And I'm going to use a few feed. Do we have any new fish in here? What are you, sir? Hey, come here, come here. What kind of fish is this? I think it's a carp. And it's a crustacean or crucian. <laughs> and it's worth $310. So I don't think this is the pond. I'm not seeing any mystery fish icons showing up. But I did manage to figure out that there are very specific ways you have to balance the population of fish in your ponds and your waterfalls and places like that in order to find certain fish. So was it in the mountain stream? Change fish. Goldfish and eel. No. I know I figured out a new fish species and I was so excited to show you guys. I just don't remember where it was. Oh, you can't fish in the waterfall. That's right. All right. Oh, and there's a little thing down here in the beach. So what do we find? Let's appraise the mystery harvest. Dun, 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 dun. It's bananas! Woohoo! Local bananas! So I can't remember. Was it over here? Did I find something in the pond? I know I, I like discovered a new fish species. Was it in the stream? Hmm. There's killifish. Not in the stream. Well, we'll figure it out. Don't you guys worry. Uh, let's see. Change fish. Goldfish. Carp. Killifish. No. Yet, so we will figure it out. I'll figure the fish part out. Oh, flower tour is complete. We host different tours through different parts of our wonderful little park to see what can be seen. Let's see, what do we want to do? Maybe a mountain tour or a waterfall tour? No, what's one of the more popular tours? I'm trying to remember. I think the cherry blossom, the beach tour is the beach tour popular. All right, let's see. Popularity high for the cave tour. Okay. So I want to have a cave tour. Let's come over here. Can we do a cave tour? All right, we've got the price, we've got the feed, we've got the wood. Let's go ahead and it's very popular among foreign women. There we go. And we're gonna host the little tour and that should attract lots of cool people to come and check out what we've got going on over here. And our Hot Springs Inn is doing very well, it seems. 
So since I can't remember what fish we're looking for, and unlocking all of the different varieties of fish are part of the challenge of the game, let's go ahead and just spend today looking through some of our specialty items that we've got hidden away. Let's see, fishing history. Ooh, fish guide. Ooh. We have currently found five types of fish. The eel, the goldfish, killifish, cru uh, crucian, and the carp. The carp is pretty darn big too. They get to a big, pretty big size. They're worth a lot of money. We'll probably work on that in a little bit. Uh, where are our specials? These are our cards. And there's our specialties. All right, do we want to use these right now? Local banana and a fresh milk. I want to see what the local banana does. When you use the local banana, that should attract lots of people. Hooray! So that means lots and lots of people are gonna show up on top of everything else. Oh, and it's a traveling card salesman. Does he have anything we want? A rice field cards, grove cards, spring cards, removal cards. We could always use more removal cards, but we can study those ourselves. Um, forest cards, we actually have pretty much everything he's offering. I'm gonna grab another rice field card just in case. In fact, I'll grab two rice field cards just to have on hand. There we go. So that's the pumpkin salesman. He comes by and the different cards that we have right here can actually be used on these different wastelands. Oh, an explorer has come to visit. Hello, I came to do a little cave exploring. Those damp, dripping caves were perfect for exploring. It was awesome. By the way, I found this in the deepest part of one of the caves. Take it. <gasps> I got Mossy Leaf Fish Park times one? What does that mean? More foreign tourists? I wonder what the heck that meant. Mossy Leaf Fish Park is the name of our park. Did he find like an alter ego world with our park? That's interesting. That's very interesting indeed. But yeah, we need to unlock a whole bunch of different fish because unlocking more species of fish will unlock different specialties and they will help us grow. But we also need to work on the next rank. We need to get, ooh, wow. So we're not very high on the biggest fish catches. We're not very high on the popularity. We're not even very high on the nature for richest environment. Oh man, well, we'll work on that. We need to get the next title is what I meant. And so that means saving up $150,000 so that we can open up the, the very last title of the ultimate park. And that will hopefully let us unlock these last expansions. Oh, there's another, there's another harvest. I need to stop appraising things if I want to save up that much money, but I can't help it. Aw, it's just a grasslands card. That's okay. Well, we should probably work on our, like, working on getting some of these areas looking a little nicer if that's the way it's gonna be. Should I upgrade the cave? I think I can't upgrade it while it has a tour going. Can I upgrade the farm? Improve the farm. Um, let's go ahead and make fences at the farm. That sounds like a good idea. And I'm gonna go ahead and appraise this mystery harvest just because I'm curious on what's inside. And it's just $10. Well, that was a horrible payoff. All right, so fishing, fishing, fishing. Hmm. I'm trying to remember. I was so excited because I figured out the fish and I was like, I can't wait to show everybody and we can start unlocking everything and it'll be real fun. And then we waited too long. So I'm gonna go ahead, uh, is there any? Any mystery cards? Sometimes when you go fishing in some of these ponds, there's like chest hiding on the bottom and little mystery cards waiting for you. I see a fish. Hello, mystery fish. Oh, no, mystery fish, I wanted the chest. We found a mystery chest. I wanted the mystery chest. Oh, there's two mystery chests. All right, well, mystery, oh, there's three. Oh my gosh, this pond is full of treasure. It's a pond full of treasure and a giant carp. Not bad. All right, let's go ahead. I want those mystery chests. Da na 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 na. Let's find out what's hiding inside them. And then next time we can work on finding different sp fish species. All right, one chest. And we got a grove card. Wonderful, wonderful. All right, what's in the next chest? Okay, get to it, get to it before the fish do. All right. And it's a removal card, which is very useful. And last little chest. What's hiding inside? Eh. Yay, treasure! The Grove card, all right. So we finished up with that. Gonna go back to the map and feed these little fish. Cause I took fish and then you can do Kamehameha Fishaha and throw in some fish. There we go. That increases the population. All right. 
and there's just treasure everywhere and I'm gonna do my best to ignore it and we're improving our little farm. Yay! Wow, that gave it a huge, bo huge boost. So it's still farm level two, popularity of 35, environment of 43, and fame of 45. Wonderful, that makes me very happy. All right, I cannot remember even though I'm sitting here going, come on, come on, come on, come on. I cannot remember how I figured out how to unlock a bunch of the new fish, but I cannot wait to show you guys next time. I'm gonna save up a bunch of money and then we will go fishing, try to unlock the new fish and try to finish expanding this area. And once we finish Fish Pond Park, which I'm very excited to be able to do in the future, then we are going to move on to some of the other absolutely adorable Cairo games that I cannot wait to share with you guys. So I will see you guys next time. Let's hope for lots and lots of awesome funs and I'll see you then, guys. Bye-bye.